Hello students, in this video, we will discuss about 8255 PPI in mode 1 operation. Mode 1 operation is also called as strobed IO mode. Strobed IO mode operation is also called as handshaking IO mode. In handshaking IO mode, we have port A 8 lines and port B 8 lines has IO ports and the remaining Port C lines are used for strobe signals. Those strobe signals are also called as handshake signals. Mode 1 operation allows the programmer to disallow or allow a specific I.O. device to interrupt the CPU without affecting any other device in the actual interrupt structure. And in order to enable this handshaking signals, we need to use port C signals that to in BSR mode, bit set reset mode. For port A, port C lines from PC3 to PC5 provides strobe lines. Strobe lines are also called as handshake lines and port P6 and P7 are used as simple input-output independent data lines. For port B lines, the control lines used are port C from PC0 to PC2. This PC0 to PC2 are used as strobe lines. They are also called as handshake lines. The operation of handshake La signals for input operation in mode 1 of 8255 is listed below. The sequence is listed below. Now, the first step in evaluating this operation is that the input device places data in data lines of port A or port B. This is communicated to 8255 by making the strobe line low because here strobe have an bar active low signal when strobe line is active low then the control signals are applied through pc4 for port a and pc2 for port b then 8 to 5 5 acknowledges the receipt of data to the input by making input buffer full ibf is input buffer full of port a high this signal is active high this also indicates that the data has been latched into the input port that means it is ready then 8255 makes the interrupt request intr for port a high and implies an interrupt to the processor. The meaning is that 825 gives an interrupt signal to the processor. Then this signal is applied only when this interrupt enable flag is high. And this flag is high when the input to PC4 and PC5 are high. The meaning is that now PC4 can control INTA interrupt flag enable for port A and this can be set by using BSR mode. Now the processor can read data from external device corresponding to this input port and this can be done by providing 8255 read signal as active low. When an active low signal is given to the read signal, then the processor reads the data from an external device. When this read signal goes low, then the INTR request signal will be deactivated, reset. And when this read signal goes high, then the input buffer full is deactivated. By this, we can see that 8255 PPI in mode 1 allows an input device to request service from CPU by simply sending its data 
into port and activating strobe signal.